the United Nations airlifted 10 tons of emergency food into the Somali capital, Mogadishu, on July 27, in order to relieve victims of the famine. Some 3.7 million Somalis, almost half of the population, are going hungry as a result of the drought that hit over 11.6 million people across what local media has dubbed the Triangle of Death, a region that straddles Kenya, Somalia and Ethiopia. We've got 14 tons on board this aircraft which has just landed today here in, in Mogadishu. Uh, over the coming days uh, we'll be bringing in an extra 60 tons of this uh, special ready-to-use food which comes in uh, in sachets. It looks a bit like uh, peanut butter. It's very uh, nutritious, full of vitamins and micronutrients and it's for the treatment of malnutrition in children and it's the first plane in the in the airlift according to the UN's refugee agency there are about 400,000 displaced people in the capital with about 1,000 new arrivals each day it is estimated that 100,000 people have arrived in the city over the last two months alone WFP has set up 16 feeding centers across the capital providing hot meals to new arrivals by using supplies delivered from Kenya and Tanzania. Nadia Idrisman, Al Arabiya.